What's up guys, Andrew Scrib coming at you today with a brand new video. Today's video is going to be an unboxing of Dawn of the Dead. This is the XT Blu-ray uh, 4 disc collector's box set, limited to 1,000 copies. I was lucky enough to snag one of these, picked it up last weekend from a Diabolic DVD. They were charging about $79.99, so it is an expensive set. Uh, however, I really do like the set and I think it is definitely worth the price. Um, yeah, let me get right into this. Also, uh, shout out to Diabolic DVD. They were super quick with the shipping on this. I had ordered it um, on that Friday and it arrived that Monday. So pretty quick shipping on their part and uh, I was definitely happy for that. So yeah, the front cover, just the classic uh, cover art on there. Back, it's all in German. Uh, it is. It says region B. This is a region free set. I did have some problems playing it on my Xbox One. Two of the four discs were working. Um, the other two were not playing. I uh, tried it on another Xbox, same problem. Tried it on my PlayStation 4 and my Blu-ray player, no problem. So I don't know if there's some kind of coding problem with this for Xbox Ones or what, but uh, it is region free. I did test it and it does work. Um, but yeah, I'll go over the set here. Um, this is the front cover here. And then on the back side of that, some more cover art. And then when you open it, you get these two. And in here comes some uh, some lobby cards. I believe these are just the different covers of the movie for different countries. This is probably my favorite one right here. And the uh, traditional. Um, and then also, once you open that, it has the four discs right there. So yeah, the four discs, you get four cuts of the film. Uh, you get the US theatrical, the complete cut, the extended cut, and the Euro cut. So the US theatrical is just the standard cut. Um, that's the only one I've seen up until I got this release. It's actually George Romero's uh, preferred cut of the film. Then they did make the director's cut, which just had a few extra um, gore scenes. I believe one of those scenes was a, a screwdriver um, in one of the zombies' ears. And then there are the Euro cut, which is also known as the Argento cut. Um, the difference with that one is, um, I believe it has all of the gore from the extended cut, but it has more of the goblin music, and as well as um, it cut out a lot of the humorous things in the movie, like the pie scene and stuff like that. Then the complete cut is the longest running uh, cut of the film. I believe that's out there right now. Um, it, it's pretty long. I mean, it's well over two hours. And it. Uh, the only downside I've been hearing about that cut of the film is that it has a lot of unreleased footage that was from the VHS um, transfer. So basically you're gonna get blu-ray quality transfer there's gonna be a few scenes that's gonna have some VHS um, quality on the transfer so it's not gonna look the best um, and I just hear it kind of goes on way too long there's a lot of like unnecessary scenes and it's it can get boring at parts um, my preferred version is probably gonna be the extended cut um, the, the Argento cut is pretty good being that um it cuts out a lot of some of the boring stuff in the movie some scenes where it just kind of went on too long there's no reason for it that part is good however it is more of a serious take on the film i kind of do like some of the humorous things that are in the film um but that is removed but the music is definitely better with the the Dar the argento cut um yeah i mean i think that's the full unboxing of that uh great film i definitely would say it's probably my favorite in the entire franchise um, I do like the remake quite a bit. This is definitely up there though, better than, I like this more than Day of the Dead, Night of the Living Dead. Um, uh, I haven't seen some of the newer ones. I know they just came out with uh, Day of the Dead Bloodline, I believe. I haven't seen it yet. I haven't heard really great things about it. Um, but yeah, I mean, that's the full uh, unboxing of this film, guys. Um, I definitely like this set. It's, it's hard to get now. Like I said, it's limited to only a thousand. Um, I think Dolly Bollock is sold out of these by now. Um, 
But yeah, if you guys have any questions, leave me a comment down below. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching.